thousands are looking for a place to stay that is safe during a firestorm and the pandemic. And that includes a pregnant woman. Yeah, here's CBS 13's Rachel Wolf. How, how is your house? I don't know. <laughs> for evacuees sleeping in their cars, the hardest part is not knowing what the future holds. It's difficult for me because I'm pregnant. This woman was staying in the parking lot at Crosswalk Community Church in Napa, one of 70,000 people told to leave Napa and Sonoma counties because of the glass fire. We heard the sirens go off, and that's when we knew we had to leave. Jetsiri Rivas left at 4 Monday morning with her entire family. After staying at the church, she was directed to Napa Valley Community College. Oh, they're no. giving them out right now. The emergency shelter is handing out toiletries, sanitizer, and masks, and beds are six feet apart to prevent against the spread of COVID 19. And to add to accommodations for evacuees who can't stay inside, there are these hand washing stations and also outdoor bathrooms. Both shelters housing more than 600 people and their animals. The Mangia family. Is thankful for the help. We are trying to get a hotel for for each family. Uh, we're still waiting for it. A wait and watch game as the glass fire rages. Are you scared? Tiene miedo? Uh, uh, un poco. Yeah. Un poco. This man says he's a little scared, but like many, appreciates the help. We have everything here. It's good. It's like a home. Like a home, but no place like their home for those who are hurting. We hope not, nothing bad is happening to my house because, oh my God, we don't want to lose it.